why you are sleeping without saying good night? Is, is everything okay? Am I baby? Please, I'm just tired. I need to rest, please. <laughs> Which one is you need to rest when the night is still young? What, what, what's the... Uh, what? I know you are joking, right? <laughs> Can you just stop this? Stop. Stop with this, your lover boy of a thing. See, do something different. Oh, okay, something like what? <laughs> like... Something adventurous. Uh, you um uncoffing my hands. Uh, or maybe you tie my legs. You choke me. And and Bella! Bella! Bella, do you realize you're a married woman? Mm-hmm. Well, you know, sometimes I wonder, I wonder if this thing sinks into you that you're married. What, what, what do you mean? I uh, mean, your husband, I, I, I should handcuff you, uh, I, I should choke your neck and uh, strangle you, you in the name of God. Why should I strangle my wife, choke you, and handcuff you, squeeze you, and press you to, to, to make love to you, Bella? Anu says a married man cannot have sex or good love making with the husband. Babe, you are a man. I need to feel the man in you. I need to feel that energy, that strength, strength, not, not, not this lover boy of a thing. Uh, 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 Bella, so, <laughs> okay, so it's only when you want it we can have it. <laughs> okay, well, we'll try that your uh, adventurous one later. Eh? For now, let's just do this one and sleep. It's not, it won't take time. It's just something we'll just do now and sleep. See, 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 see. I'm no longer interested. Please, maybe next time. You want it will be doing it. Better you will give this thing to me. I want you will we 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 the the best the least you will do is work for the boss. You must give me the oh, I you know my wife. Can you just stop? Stop. What is it? Mm. <laughs> ooh, ooh. She left. <laughs> Now I have to put an end to this. If I don't stop this now, it will continue. No, not in this house. In my house. house. In, ah, in my house. This anymore. I, just, I need a break. You need a break? From what? A break from, from, from the abnormality you call sexual preference. I'm, I'm a sucker for romance. I, I sit in my office and imagine sweet romantic scenarios only to come home to my wife, the woman I call my wife to execute them with. I wonder like, what, what, what do you do? You, you shut me out, you turn me down. You, you, just because you want to be raped. Must you do this all the time? 
That one month we, 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 we're going to keep up with that. I can't, I can't continue with it. Jessie, this is who I am. You got married to me like this. This is me. Deal with it. This is not who you are. This is who you think you are. And we can fix this. Do you think I'm not trying? Jesse? I am trying! I am trying! But, 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 how, but, what? How, how do I know when you, you're not coming out? You, you don't want us to walk out on this. Actually, every solution we've, we've put in place to help out this situation ends up not working because you're, not, you're, you're, you're just not ready for this whole thing. Please come out of it. Let's walk out something. Baby, let's, let's walk out something. Is not educated. Ebitimi 
is is is, is local. Ebuka uh, 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 is not good in bed. So annoying. What do you want? Look at you, Bella. Talking of good in bed, have you sorted out your issues? Huh? Sorted what? Let's, let's talk something else. Oh, Pat! Thank you for bringing us back to the main topic because you see, right now, this is more important. Bella, why are you acting up like you don't know what she's talking about? I don't. Oh, really? You want me to remind you? Now, let me tell you something. JC is lovable. I mean, that guy is madly in love with you. And with the look of things, he's doing everything to make the whole thing work for you guys. But you're not even ready to give in. Uh -huh. Yes, and the one seeing you right now, you still don't want to give in. Now, let me advise you, baby girl. Hmm? Loosen up. You are too stiff for that oh, girl. Oh. Oh. What is she trying to say? Bella, we are your friends and it's a duty bar to tell you the truth. If we don't, no one else will. Yeah. Just say, he's a very nice man. He's a loving man. Just give him a try. Do you understand? If you push him too hard, he might bounce at you. Tell her that. Do you understand? Please, give him a chance. I promise you, you won't regret it. All right, I have heard all what you said. I will try on my best to fix my marriage, okay? But then, enough of me. Let's go back to this girl, this lady in white. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> of course! Oh, my goodness. What did I do again this time, guys? Go on, get, get married. married! Oh! Like, seriously. Yes! Mm -hmm. Like, seriously. Oh, you need a man in your life. Trust me, I will. All right? Really? You just give me some time. I promise to get married soon. Wow, good news. I can't wait. Please, let's wake up to this. Cheers, ladies. Make you scream that loud. Talk to me. I saw him again. Why won't he stop? Don't let it bother you, okay? Don't let it bother you. Okay? Let's go back to bed. But well, this time you come closer, so don't worry. Everything will be fine, okay?
You know, I thought this whole thing would end when we get married. But it's getting worse by the day, and I don't know what to do. Jason, my friend. You see, what's happening to your wife is not um, something you can stop with mere words. You need to back up those words with some action. You know, she went through um, a psychological trauma and it mad her for life. So I think you need to do something that will affect her mind positively. So... So what are you suggesting? a romantic gesture. You know, women are always moved by that. You know, I was actually thinking towards that direction. Maybe I think that's what I'll do. I'll try that. Hmm. I've thought of this before. Maybe I'll just give it a try. Thinking. See, that's the problem with you. You're always thinking, but you never act. Just stop thinking and act. Act, my friend. You're always thinking, you've thought and thought and thought, and you've even forgotten to offer your friend something to drink. Oh, sorry, sorry about that. Um, we, we could actually step out and get something. Let me, let me just get my keys. We'll step out and get something. Get your keys. Mr. Tenka. perfection of you. That's why I put this all up for you. I I I love this. <laughs> oh, I love it. You do? You like this. So I know that my man is romantic at heart. Uh, but I've never seen you in this mood before. Come on, come on, tell me, what are we celebrating? Well, as you can see, we're celebrating love. You know, I love you so much, right? I love you so much, and that's the reason I put all of this up. This symbolizes love and that's why I had to put this up for you. You know I love you so much and I can't live a day without you. You'll always be my baby. Hey, 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 baby. Oh, not that. Please. Somebody stop. Must we do this all the time? I don't want to go to you and stop. I don't want that to go. Did you just stop? Stop this! Enough! Enough! Why are you doing this? Must we do this all the time? What does 
supposed to take things easy and you, you, you. Do, see, there's a, 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 a huge difference between satisfaction and, and, and tiredness. Have you ever had real orgasm in your life? Have you had real orgasm in a while? Let's take this thing slow and steady till we get to the peak. You'll enjoy this thing. Let's give that a try. It must not be rough all the time. But you should make me feel like I'm raping you always. Let's do this. This is what I want. For. This romantic session works more. Take a chance at this. This will work. That's the reason I want us to do this. I will never go through that journey with you. Never! Baby, did you just hit me? No. But you had the guts to raise your hand at me. Baby, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Baby, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. Get out of my sight. Let me. What do you want? I shouldn't be the one asking you that! 
When will I see that? What, 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 what do you want? What, what do I want? What do you want? Do you want Bella? What do you want? You know what I want. You know what I want. You know it. God! to give to me this morning. What happened to good morning? How are you doing, babe? Okay, I'm sorry. Good morning, babe. So? So what? So what, woman? Listen, I do not have money for whatever expenses you want to use it for. Okay? But you promised me. Remember, I promise is a promise, so... Yes, I did. Only so I can have some peace of mind. What? Dave, so you deceived me again. Listen, let me tell you, okay? I am sick and tired of maintaining your extravagant life, your expensive lifestyle outside, okay? I will no longer continue to maintain that lifestyle for you. You hear me? <laughs> Dave, you see that money? You will give it to me whether you like it or not. Go to work. You'll come back to this house and get some. Listen, I do not have time for your nonsense. I need to go to work. Okay, go. Jason, you sounded so worried over the phone. Hope all is well. Sis, I'm not enjoying this thing called my language anymore. Bella, 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 Bella is turning me into something I'm not, and it's frustrating me. The Bella I know is a good one. What is really going on between the both of you? Is that there's something you're not telling me? Sis, can you believe Bella wants me to break her each time we're making out? Like she wants me to either choke her, strangle her, ch chain her up, or, or, or handcuff her, or tie up her legs. 
It's a day it's frustrating me. Oh my god. I think this has something to do with our pastors. And this is something that calls for urgent attention. Otherwise, it's gonna break you at the marriage. Sis, I need help. I really need help. You, you know I love Bella so much and I, I, I don't want to lose her. I know. But then, there's no problem that does not have a solution. By the way, I've got something to eat today. What am I having food for? What am I eating for? I don't have appetite for food. Come on. You have to eat something. Everything will be fine. Please let me get something for you to eat. Husband must have spent a lot. I mean, the weed, the wristwatch, the dress, the shoes. I mean, wow. It must have cost him a whole lot of money. You are enjoying, you no? Know? <laughs> Come on, girl. I care less about these things. Hmm. Though, this is how my husband wants me to be dressing. But I care less about them. How are you? It's been a while, I've not seen you. Where have you been? Anyways, my husband will soon get me my, I mean, the wig, my own dress too. <laughs> Sophia, stop, please. Stop this your pretentious attitude. What? Me? Pretentious? Bella, please. Come on, Sophia, I know you. You are jealous and competitive by nature. Bella, me, competitive. How can you say this? I am not that kind of person, okay? Really? You were just talking about how my hair was very expensive, my clothes very expensive, my wash. Come on. I don't need all those things right now. All what I need for you to be a good friend to me. I have a lot in my head already. Oh, 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 I see. So now... I am not a good friend to you, Bella. Wow, it's okay. I think I have to be on my way then. Because I am not calling for all this drama. Drama? Yes, drama. Huh. Okay, fine, you can leave. But please, try and change. Sophia, you have to change this your attitude. It's not good for you. Thank you for your advice. And you too. Change your nonsense. What's your problem? Oh. Sophia, you will never change. <laughs> wow, wow, madam. Just don't fresh like nine people. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but why are you the best for my organ, madam? Uh, see, I don't have those time. Just open those gates because I need to leave now. Madam, can you take a breath? Like, 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 can you take a breath for Christ Jesus? Can, can you relax your nerves? Abu, open this gate now! Madam, breathe. Take a breath. We don't take it. Do I look like I'm smiling with you right now? No. So open those gates. I need to leave. Madam, ma, relax your nerves. I said Open this gate now! Nabu! Oh, come on now! What's going on there? Now, now your friend do. Now, now your friend. Open the gate, let her leave. I'm now, not, I'm, open the gate for her to leave. I'm, what are you saying? This, this man, they very weak. Oh my ah. Open this gate now! Fine. Just look at you. You can't even open the gate gate. <laughs> Nadia, sorry. I was trying to prank you. What is your problem? Learn how to mind your business. Okay, madam. Go. I'll mind this now.
Sophia, I really feel pity for Bella. I mean, it's not easy. It's not easy for someone to be a sex slave for two years. Like, it will take by the grace of God for her to get it off her mind. Oh, really? Baby girl. See, if she likes, she should get it off her mind. If she likes too, she can leave it in her mind. That is her business. It is not mine. Come on. I thought she's your friend. Why are you speaking of her in this manner? And so? Hey, Sophia. Look, let me tell you something, Pat. I never liked that Bella girl for any reason. I mean, she's so proud. She's so pompous. She's so arrogant. I mean, the way she carries herself like she's the almighty. Who does she think she is? What does she have? It's either today my husband took me to shopping, my husband bought me this, my husband bought me a gold wristwatch. We should run away for her. No, now. Please, 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 please. If she likes, she should get it off her mind. If she likes too, she can leave it in her mind. That is her business. It is not mine. Come on. Sophia, I'm so surprised at you. This Sambella you're speaking of is the Sambella I knew her through you. And she has been your friend. I don't have any regrets knowing her. She's a nice person. Oh, really? Nice call, nice name. See, just leave matter for Mataya, so you didn't hear me. Anyway, you won't even understand what I'm talking about. See, baby girl, do you know I have to lie to Bella that my husband took me to six different countries for her honeymoon just to meet up standard with her? Who does that? I know that was a lie. It was all cheap lies. You were only trying to do that just because we were rubbing shoulders with her. Even when I know that her husband can foot her bills. <laughs> Pat, are you the one saying this? Does Bella look like someone who will go for a honeymoon? Eh? All she wants is hard sex. And if she doesn't get it, anyway, I feel for that man called her husband. Eh? She doesn't deserve that man. Shouldn't have even got married, got married to that guy. What am I even saying? See, Bella would have gone to marry one of those stupid agberos who live all their stupid life on hard drugs. So she can be getting it harder now. Eh? What do you expect? Please, 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 please. Sophia, if you could talk about Bella that has been your friend for seven full years, what about me that you barely know? That means. One day you will talk about me the same way you've spoke about her. I'm so surprised at you. Honestly, I think I, at this point in time, we cease to be friends and I can't continue this anymore. Please. You're leaving? You want to finish your drink? Should I have their finishing? How was work today? That work. I'm not getting the best out of that work. I'm even thinking about quitting. Seriously. Do you have a job offer somewhere else? Or is there something you're not telling me? Wait. You don't have any offer from anywhere? Yet you want to quit the one you have. Can you hear yourself speak? Look, you know that the economy is really tough this period. And there's no telling when you get another job. Yet you want to quit the one you have. So I advise you better keep it though. And then I will keep it. No, don't keep it. You want to quit. Why they now. cost me now? Me, you, you be Mumu. Chooks. I'm worried. I, um, I'm really disturbed. As a matter of fact, I'm sincerely concerned about our friend Jason and his wife. What about them? Wait. I hope. 
Hope is not planning on ending that marriage. Far from it, he's not uh, planning on ending the marriage. Mm-hmm. Okay. But um, the wife seemed to be the problem because uh, she had the tendency of turning their sex session to a rape scene mm-hmm. and really killing him. I don't understand. How? How? Uh, Jason complained that Bella, his wife, always lost his heart. As if he's raping her. This is terrible. Yeah, but come on. Sex is actually supposed to be enjoyed in marriage. Hmm? Not the other way around becoming a traumatic and emotional pain. That is that is what it's supposed to be. Indeed, it's not supposed to be, my friend. But that seems not to be the case of our friend Jason here. Mm. He is, is really a serious disaster. Mm. And uh, you and I know that he loves Bella more than anything in this world. Exactly. I, I, exactly. He, he really needs help. I don't know what to do. He really needs help. I, I feel for him. Mm. Seriously, I feel for him. This is simple. Simple. How so? Well, at this point, what he needs, he and the wife, they actually need a psychologist. And I can recommend one, a very good one. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. You know a psychologist that can yes. help them? Mm-hmm. Yes, yes. Please do. Please do. Are we? No, I really feel for him. This is painful. Ah! about quitting this job. You think it bothers me with it. Are you serious about that? Hmm. I've seriously thought about quitting, but I think I have to hold on to it. Well, it's not like you now that owns this. Hey, both of your own. You can imagine. Huh? He wants to quit his job when he has nothing at hand. Then later now he starts stopping us. My humble suggestion should be no, stop looking at before me. before giving up on this one, you, you you need to get hold of another one so you don't let go of this and lose at the end without having anyone to hold. Tell him. Well, I'm actually holding on to what I have now. Oh, better, that's better. Then. Okay. That's better. Hold on. All right, I'll... Hold on. Hold on. Have you told him why we are here? Have you told him um... what? No, 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 no. I was supposed no, to tell no, you no, something. No, no. Um, what, what is no, it? No, I have not. Jason. Yeah. I have, uh, I have a suggestion. I have a therapist, also he's a psychologist, a very good one to recommend for you. Concerning your wife issue. And he's good. Just give it a try. Well, you know, we've tried a couple of them and it's all been negative, so... Um... I don't know if she will buy these ideas, seriously. My friend, you know, we've been friends for a long time now. And um, your pain is our pain. Exactly. Mm-hmm. You've tried a couple of them, but not the ones recommended from your friends. You know, so I think um, the one Chooks is recommending might really help. So how sure are you that this one will help us out? JC, just give it a try. Mm-hmm. There's no harm in trying, just book an appointment and... Okay, it's fine. I'll pass this across to her when I get home and see if she buys the idea. I'll need the details. I'll call you up No problem, no now. problem. No shaking, guy. Look at yours. <laughs> Let me get back to what I'm No, doing. we have to All go. Right, ciao. All right, Let's go now. What are you saying?
I'm going to see her tomorrow. We really need to talk. And hey, don't worry, I will send her the money tomorrow. That won't, that won't be a problem. But Dean has to see you. No, 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 no. Give me your, give me your time. I will have to see you because I want to tell you some things. I don't know. Girl. Oh, please. Baby. You're so And how long have you been standing there? Well, let's say long enough to have heard all your conversation. Wow. Hey, oh my god. Oh. So, well, I'm fine. You're looking so beautiful. Thank you. And how was my baby today? Well, I must say I'm fine. And I've got good news for you. You really? Yeah, sure. My ears are open. Speak it up. Well, it's about this psychologist. What is it? Baby, this psychologist is a professional. Baby. What is it? See, this psychologist, from what I heard, is a specialist at what he does. See, from what I heard, he's so good at what he does, and he will help us with this. He will help us procure a solution to this problem. Let's give him a try. This guy is going to help us procure a solution to our problems. Please. Let's, let's give this guy a try. It's precious. And he will help us through too. Why is she always doing this? What, what is it this time? Talk to me. What's wrong? Are you crying? I saw him again. Why won't he stop? What have I done wrong? Why do I keep seeing him? Gives you the other day. It's nothing. It's it's nothing. That's not the problem. I'm I am ready to go and see the doctor. You mean you're ready? Yes, I'm ready. So, I will, so that all this can stop. Exactly. That's what I've been trying to pull through to you. This is the best news I've had. You see, first thing in the morning. We're going straight to his office. 
we need to heat his office, so we start immediately. Okay? Thank you so much. I love you so much. Thank you for loving me. I love you so much, dear. Let's go back to bed. First thing in the morning, we're heating his office. Okay? Thank you. Let's put an end to this once and for all. Thank you so much, huh? Thank you. I love you. Thank you, mom. Let's go back to bed. This is my wife, Bella. You're welcome. And, uh, um, remember, uh, as regards what I told you over the phone, and that's the reason I brought her. Um, I need to rush off to get something, and um, I can't pick her up much later. So I'll just... Okay. Yeah. Um, so I guess I can take my leave now. Uh, my job here is done, so... You're just... welcome. <laughs> All right, bro. All right, thank you, sir. Yes. yes. something important you wanted to discuss with me yeah okay um sorry babes um as you can see i'm all dressed up um sorry it's coming this late i'm actually going for an interview interview yes for what for a job what yes you heard me God. What's funny? Like seriously, you will never stop. How do you mean? I am sure this is one of those your schemes that you use to extort money from me, isn't it? <sighs> right? Babe, come on. See, I got talking with Bella the other day. Do you know that despite the fact that Bella's husband is rich and can afford Anything she wants, Bella is a full housewife. Just look at me. And I was busy trying to compete with her, trying to meet up standard with her. So I, I just decided to go out there, look for a job, so I can support us. You don't like it. Wait, wait. You are serious about this? <sighs> Babes, I'm serious. You thought about this all by yourself. That you're gonna get a job and become productive. Yes! Babe, do you know what this means? This is a good thing! Wow, you like it? Are you kidding me? This is what I've been asking for all this while. Oh yeah? Oh my god! Are you serious? Listen, I promise, okay? If this is what you really want to do, I mean if you're serious about this whole thing, that mm -hmm. you're actually going out there to get a job, yeah. to support this family. Sure. Then I'm going to support you in any way that I can. Whatever you want, okay? If for this reason I'm going to give you more cash, then tell me what you need. I'll, I'll give it to you. I promise. Really? Yes. Okay. 
Wow, this is great news. Mm -hmm. You go get a job, okay? Okay. I need to go to work, though. Okay, but wait, the money. I will give. You're so unbelievable. The young lady, um, from all these things that I've uh, been written down about you, I, I perceive that um, you are a victim of masochism. If you do not understand what it means, I'll explain to you. You see? A masochist is somebody that derives pleasure from pain. Uh, the thing now is that um, I do not want you to confuse it with a sadist or sadism. Because while a sadist derives pleasure from inflicting pain on others, a masochist derives pleasure from receiving pain. You see, a masochist cannot uh, enjoy sex without pain being inflicted on him on her. Again, you see, both a sadism or sadism and masochism, they all dwell within the environment of pain. But the good news there is that um, masochism is, is curable. It is curable, you see. Um, we can salvage you. All that we need to do is to... Uh, cut the crap, Donna. I beg your pardon? You are the reason why my life is like this. Because of your wickedness. Young lady, I will advise that you watch your language. Answer. of the thief, while the pain of the borrower is joy better. You can call me a service if you like. Yes. You destroy my life. No. No, not at all. I brought out the real you. No! Yes! Tell me you did not Enjoy me digging into you hard and fast. Tell me. No. You did not enjoy the spanking and the choking. Tell me. Pain, sadness is relative. When you do the unconventional, people tend to despise you. But pain to me is sweet. Yes. Pain brings out the real me. Who you are right now. 
is who you are supposed to be when you do the unconventional people tend to despise you yes but you see i only give an opportunity for you because i know you enjoy everything and now if that bastard that calls himself your husband is not able to take care of you come come to me come home no i created the monster No. No. Yes. Laundry man, are you? So that, so that you won't break this gate. Can you buy this gate? Can you buy this gate? Okay. Now you won't break this gate. Yeah, my dad. No get respect though. He doesn't have single respect. So I, I ask the question. They ask me on top of question. Yeah. Okay. Respect me. Oh. This is my office. Respect me as a gate man. And my office do so. G waiting. M gate man. Well, well. My mother and they. Why wants my mother? I won't give him this clothes. Oh, oh, okay, her clothes? Yes. No, 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 no. It, it's not for you. Hmm? It's for her only. I have for that business to come. Hey, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Laundry man, get another business with madam. Uh, you hear yourself first. Like, laundry man, have a business with madam. Okay, no match. Okay, no cut. Will you, will you come here? I'm going to pour your intestine here. I'm going to pour it on the ground. Pour it, pour it. Give me good. Okay, I'll give you your own set. Okay. I said, I want to see your madam. I want to have that business with her. Okay, I'm going to have a resisted. Okay, Can't mind your business. I said, I want to see your madam. Okay, I'll time have a. If he shot, if, hey, while, 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 while. Well, like that, if he, if he shot here, I'll, I'll pull it and I'll and, and, and go. I think when you go, I talk to you. Come with me, I'll let go. Don't let go. I'll get out for me. Abu. 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 Madam. Okay, madam. What's going on here? No, be, no, be this, no, be this foolish laundry man. What's that? What's that? He won't go see you. He won't drop clothes, say you get another business with you. I said, give me clothes, make a gift for you. So I say, I go bring that to you. He said, 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 he Why are you embarrassing my laundry guy? Huh? Anyway, I brought your clothes so. Okay. Thank you so much. I hope you are all in charge. Yeah, yeah, let me And it's well clean. Sure. Okay, I'll send you the cash to us in the evening. The remaining one. No problem. Madam, before we're a man, I'm going to talk to you. If not, I open this gate. I'm going to put this guy this time for granted. Teeth, teeth, teeth for row for granted. Abu, open this gate. Let me open this gate for you. While 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 I can open this gate, make I make I make I make I blow.
Bella. I really think you should uh, stop coming here. My husband paid you to help me get over my mental challenges. He drops me by himself every day for my section. What do you expect I do? Wait until he leaves, then sneak out to some other place. You know, I, I admire your loyalty to your husband. Keep your compliments to yourself. Bella, I am of the opinion that we should put our time to good use. You know, like old times. Yes. I know you still long for those days. You know, I can fulfill all your fantasies. <laughs> Amongst all my captives, you were the most interesting. You kept trying to escape and I kept catching you. Until you succeeded eventually. You left a very sweet memory in my heart. I can never forget you. Yes. And, um, Never forget you. Bella, we can review the moments right here in this office. See, don't forget about me looking old. I still have a strength of 10 men. So, Bella, what is this? Okay. okay. But not today. Why? Oh. So, so when, when? A day after tomorrow. Okay. Okay. A day after tomorrow then. Sure. Day after tomorrow then. On my way now. My husband should be here by now. Okay, um, be after tomorrow. Yeah. And I can I can wait. I'll be here for you. Alright. Bye. Dr. Donald. for my wife um because i'm seeing improvement oh wow that's that's lovely that's lovely Jason. yeah what can we do you know we only cancer it's only god in heaven that delivers yeah sure he does yes. i'll be rushing home to my wife uh okay. she left her home okay all right um, one more thing sir i have this friend of mine who wants to reach you through your facebook or instagram handles um, and it's about his sister. She lost her boyfriend and she's not been able to get over it. So he suggested you and he's been trying to reach you. So I want to pass it across to him to be able to reach you online. Um, tell him to come now. Tell him to come see me. You, you know how to find me. Um, he's a very busy fellow and that's the reason I'm requesting for you. So, so he could reach you. Well, um... I, um, I, I am not on Instagram, and um, you can find me on Facebook under the name Malvin Bassey. Malvin? Yeah, Malvin. That is the name my mother gave to me. Oh, okay. Yes, but I prefer uh, Donald because it sounds more professional. Oh, because of what? And um, it's, it's my father's name. I was named after my father. 
Yeah. Because I was actually wondering, do now have Marvin? Uh, it's, it's, it's fine, sir. It's okay. I'll get that across to him, and he'll possibly reach you pretty soon. Um, let me rush home to my wife, because I actually left her home. Okay. Thank you once again, All right. Sir. My regards. Thank you very much. Huh? She'll hear. Yeah. Thank you, sir. All right. Take to be and obey it joyfully. Are you sure about this, Bella? Are you hundred percent sure? Even as two hundred percent. See, if that is the case, don't worry about it. I will be fine. In fact, I am fine. And oh, hey, hey, that reminds me. And what about um, Sophia? It's been long ahead from her. Girl, I've missed that girl. What is the problem? I've not been seeing she has not been picking my calls. Anyways, I tried reaching out to her, but I mean, she isn't taking my calls too. I think she's fine. Are you sure she's, she's alright? That is so unlike her. Anyways, nothing. I'm not sure there's anything wrong with her. Because I remember the other day I went to her house, her gatekeeper told me that she's she's not around. I think maybe when she comes back, she will definitely come. Or maybe come around. Babe, is there anything you are not telling me? Tell me, don't worry. Tell me. Come on, girl. If there's anything to tell you, I would definitely do that, Jeff. But I think. Maybe when she comes back, she will definitely call. Okay, well, fine. I just miss her, girl. I've missed her a lot. Same here, girl. So, what's, what's happening with you? Looking gorgeous. Oh my goodness, you can say that again. Babe, I'm starving. Like, I'm really hungry. Did you cook anything? Yeah, I made mokutika and jollof rice. Do you care for some? Of course, girl. Look at girl. Please, let's go to the kitchen. All right. <laughs> That bastard that calls himself your husband is not able to take care of you. Come, come to me. Come home. I created the monster. And I contain to it. Thank you. 
Actually, Mr. Donald Marvin Bassi. Of course, that's his name, Mr. Donald. Did you also know he was arrayed for kidnap, rape, and murder two years ago in Calabar? What are you talking about? What has the psychologist got to do with uh, rape and kidnap? I think I'm joking. I actually think I'm joking. Hold on. Read this. Hmm. Hmm. What's going on here? What's happening? He may have succeeded in bribing his way out from prison. Hmm. But I bet you that's definitely the same guy. You can see he, he, he's the one, but. But what? But what? Can't you see the connection? Ah. By the way, where did you say Bella was held captive again? In a, in a forest, in a forest somewhere in, in, in Calabar. Hmm? It's the same man. Oh. Hmm. Jason, Jason, where did you say Bella is? No, 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 Bella is a... As, as we speak right now, she's at the man's office. Uh, and yeah, but, uh, and usually I go to drop her off there, but this morning she left very early mm -hmm. in a car. Mm -mm. I don't think she's safe. She's not even safe, and we need to do something at the moment. She's definitely not safe. Mm -hmm. See, guys, whatever has to do with this project must be suspended. I need to get my wife because my wife is my priority. I need to get my wife now. Are you sure about this thing? A hundred percent. You saw it yourself. What is actually the guy that? What are you doing? I just killed you.
Why did you do what you did, young woman? You better start talking else. You will get more torture here before your lawyer comes. You want to know why I did what I did? Yes. Start talking. Fine. I will tell you. What would you have done if you were being raped and abused? We may nine over and over for years without no one. I mean, no one coming to rescue or save you. want to talk to if it was your child detective what would you have done would you have killed him the same way I did or better still Arrest him. Then, after some years, he writes his way out of jail and continue from where he stopped. Get down with this already. I miss you. I cannot wait to have you just like I used to have you when you were just nine years old. The memory is still fresh in my head. Yes. Let's get going. Well, thank you so much, Dr. Donald, for this information. It's not alone to put you behind bars. You will die before you get to that door. What do you? Something is sent you. Vera. Dr. Donna, you are under arrest. Whatever you say here, I will do. Now move it. 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 See, we're actually enjoying our marriage yeah. right now, and uh, we're grateful to you for coming through for us. Um, uh, I can see a lot of changes. You know, over time, we've been trying to procure solutions as regards this, but it's never been working. I want to thank you because my my wife is in good shape, as you can see, and I'm actually enjoying my marriage. 
She no longer watches porn. She, uh, <laughs> she, <tell her. laughs> she no longer watches porn, and I'm cool with the whole thing. She she will vibe differently now. And, You're welcome, uh, Mr. Jason. You. You're welcome. Thank you so much. I'm glad I could help. You know, here uh, we can't sell, but God perfects everything when you believe. Exactly. Really. So uh, for now, if there's anything you notice about your wife, if if there is any trauma, if she goes back to watching porn, please feel free to come to our office. It won't be necessary. <laughs> you know, we stayed home for a while and we noticed everything has been going smoothly. So it's not necessary. We want to take our leave. We need to see some okay. friends and all. Thank you so much. I'm glad I could help. Oh sure, sure. sure. Thank you very much. Um, baby. <laughs> we cannot. No, I can help you with this. <laughs> <laughs> Have a nice day. Maybe I want to thank you for making me feel like a man for the very first time in this marriage. You see, the first day I met you, I told you about wanting to spend forever and a day more with you. I told you I pictured a future with you and that fulfillment is what I bask in right now. I feel very fulfilled. Having that love-making session have I ever visualized coming true? I love you so much. Thank you so much. I should be thanking you for listening to me. I have nothing more to say than to say thank you. Thank you for being my husband. Thank you for loving me all through these hard times. You were there for me. You never let me go. I don't know how to thank you enough. Of course, you know. <laughs> it's the reason I'm I just... you. I have to stand by you. Come on, stop it. <laughs> and I pray that in my next life, I should have a husband like you. Because it's been my prayer to have you as my wife <laughs> in the next life. Come here, darling. I love you so much. Hi guys, my name is Anoka Constance Kelechi and I'm on the set of Obsession. Obsession is a movie that is complicating. Yeah, because um, Bella was actually raped and for that reason, she couldn't make out with the husband. And I am playing the role of Sophia, Bella's friend. And my own case is, I'm very jealous. I gossip her behind her back. And I just want to be like her. But yet, I, I can still be like her. So that's why I said it's very complicated. So um, it's a good one. The story is perfect. You know? So this is um, day five. So we're still pushing it. And Florence Edem is someone I met. I've known her for a while. But on this job, She's the EP and she's a wonderful person. She's also nice. She's fun to be with and she's playing um, Bella. So she's my competitor. <laughs> so in fact, it's nice, working, it's nice actually working with her and I wish to work with her more often. Yeah. My director in the person of um, Isaac Otto, he's a nice person. 
he's not been difficult. Even when you make mistakes, he he's always wanting you to correct it and take it slow and steady. He's a nice person to work with, actually. Like, he's been treating us well. He's not harsh. He doesn't shout at you. But sometimes, too, he can be mean. Yes, like, when he's rolling the camera, don't dare to upset him because you won't believe him. So behind the cameras, you guys can laugh. And he's a wonderful person generally, so that's it. The crew, everybody, wonderful. So I love to work with them again and again and again. My name is Ubi Samuel, uh, a movie maker, a, a DGN member, an AMP member, a lecturer. Um, I'm on the set of Obsession, uh, written and uh, written, produced and directed by another DGN director, Isaac Otoho. The story is a very, very pathetic one. The character I'm playing, Dr. The, Dr. Donald, the guy is a sick guy. Very sick. Very, very sick. And unfortunately, he's the reason why Bella is the way she is. And unfortunately, and coincidentally, Bella's husband is he bringing Bella to him to fix. You see the twist? You know, it's, the story is interesting. Uh, the script, the script, the script is. Um, I'm Wana Chobeki. I'm on set on a movie titled Obsession, produced by Florence Edel and directed by director Isaac Futuro Um I play the role of a therapist who helped, who helped Bella get back to her sanity in her marriage uh, so that she can actually work uh, well with her husband when it comes to uh, making love with her husband. It's actually a good movie, it's educative, it helps uh, couples, it helps young ladies who have been abused through rape. So I, I helped her to educate her that she's not, um, she, she's, she's not damaged in any way but just that she's a strong survivor. Okay, I know there are lots of ladies who are victims of um, rape. So this movie will expose and teach you that you are not dead. You are not a victim, rather you are a survivor. Akela Steven um, right here on the set of Obsession the film produced by Florence Edem and directed by none other than director Isaac Otoho alright on this set I'm playing the character Leo referring to Jason whose uh, wife had a, a mental breakdown you know so um, just standing in as a good friend, trying to advise him, try to tell him what and what not to do in order to get the wife's mind back into her default settings. Yeah, fam, this is um, Chamberlain Charm City, and um, it was crossed light. Go, 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 go ahead, go ahead, action. I found this Chamberlain in Charm City. We're here for the big movie Obsession. It's something to look out for. Produced by Floxy. That's what I call her, but she's known as Flower Prince, a devil. And the director behind this magic is um, Isaac Otoho. The name, the name, the, he needs no introduction. He's a big name, a DGN certified director. And I'm playing Jason on this one. Jason tends to be the husband of um, Bella, who happens to be this character that has this whole um, the whole 
controversy thing the whole the obsession thing boils down to uh, Bella she has this uh, you go if I tell you everything you're not gonna enjoy it so you have to look out for this one obsession it's a mad one trust me people my name is mine edit barsi um i'm a makeup actress by the special grace of god i happen to play the role of uh, sophia and i'm also an artist and then the title of this movie is obsession hi everyone my name is miss eunice benjamin and I'm um, on the set of Obsession. And it's a very interesting movie and it's about molesting and rape and a lot of people have been hurt, but I think this would teach a lot of lesson and for ladies to really step up for themselves. And this, we have a lot of interesting actors and actors and people who make this thing look beautiful for you. And the director of the set is no other person than I. <laughs> My buddy, director Isaac Oto, or DGN, I am Director's Guild of Nigeria. He's a very nice director. I, I pray for him every day to get to the top. And I wish to I buy him like one Benz in the future. Eh? <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Just watch and learn from it. Thank you. Hello viewers, it's your girl Nkechi Michael. I'm here on a movie set titled Obsession. And I'm taking the role of a detective. This movie is going to teach you a lot, mostly the female. It's going to teach you how to stand out for yourself, how to fight for your rights, how to be on a defensive, how to defend yourself when it comes to this. You're going to learn a lot. Just sit back and wait for this. It's a hit one. And the person directing the I'm one of the characters for the movie Obsession. Um, this movie is actually a story about a young lady that was raped long before she got into marriage with her husband. And the husband happened to be my brother Jason. Uh, this is an amazing story. A lot of persons are going through um, similar, if not the same, um, mental stress and they are looking forward to getting the solution. So I advise if you are going through such a problem or you are having issue and difficulty in letting go of your past experiences in areas of rape and all of that, please this movie is the right movie for you. It will guide you on how to seek help on how to open up to your close loved ones and all of that. Now this is an amazing story shot by one and only creative Isaac with Soho and it's actually produced by Florence Eden. <laughs> it's actually produced by Florence Eden. So guys, I really can't wait for this movie to be out. And trust me, this is actually your one and only fashion designer, CAO Signature Stages. So I'll be doing some giveaway on this movie. When you watch the movie, I'll ask some, some questions. If you get my questions right, you're getting a free dread from Signature Stages. Yes, this is a record. 